Sports Night? Because I don't know anything about it. Um, Sports Night, at least in its origination, was five nights of activities for sports activities for every girl in the whole entire school. It gave everyone an opportunity to participate in something. Uh, we spent months, I should say even in my years, but in their years, they, I'm sure they spent months and months preparing. It also involved the arts department for decorations. It involved the music department for the two jazz bands. Um, and it was five nights of competition where if you had a specialty like tap or ballet or modern dance, you were allowed to show off basically your skills in a sort of specialty dance. And then you would have as a background probably an entire gym class that had learned modern or ballet enough to kind of back you up mm -hmm. in your sport. Um, there were probably somewhere between 10 and 15 different things that they competed for in which they won a point. And each night they were judged by three or four judges in the stands. And um, at the end of the five nights, whichever team had the most points won, and it was quite prestigious to win. There was so a black and red team. Right. And so it wasn't an individual competition, it was for the team. It was for the team, yes. Uh -huh. There were cheerleaders, there was everything. Okay. Yeah. And they said it was a long tradition? In it was a very long tradition, uh -huh. yes. I think since the school originated, actually. And on my understanding, one of the first high schools in the area certainly to do it, and during the 60s and 70s, a lot of local high schools ended up copying it as, a, as an idea. Of, right, right, you know, right something good, you know, in terms of participation, because they made every one of us in gym class. We all learned at least some, you know, you had to pick which dance you were going to learn, and then, and, uh, and or they just assigned, you know, entire gym class, you will learn that particular dance, and that's what you're doing.